At Gulf Specimen Marine Labs Turtle Hospital, a team of staff and interns are helping cold-shocked sea turtles that were trapped in shallow, frigid waters. Jessica Woodall is the Education and Outreach Coordinator at the Gulf Specimen Marine Lab. She explains how water near 50 degrees Fahrenheit can threaten a sea turtle's life. Anything below that makes them very lethargic and unable to hold their heads up. And that's where you run into an issue. Turtles breathe air. So if they can't lift their heads to uh, breathe air, then they're in a lot of trouble. Once at the marine lab, the turtles were warmed up until they started moving again. Then they were moved to large tanks where they are watched to ensure they're doing better. So we currently have 47 turtles at the facility which is a great number of turtles for us. The majority of the turtles that we have are greens. They're mostly juvenile green turtles, except for four or five, and those are Kemp's Ridley's. The turtles are photographed, documented, and given an ID number. Once the water warms up, it's back to the ocean for these young turtles. They all seem to be doing very well. They're swimming, so it's just a great thing to see that we managed to rescue all of those, because chances are they would not have survived.